Thursday Night Live is one of those events in my week that really helps me decompress. You must the I take my grandmother on Thursday nights to have wine and listen to jazz. Definitely do jazz, have dinner because the food is wonderful. I love it. I meet family there, I meet friends, we hang out. It's a great place to go on a date, a first date, a second date. I'm, I'm not a musician, but I love the music. Yeah. You don't have to be a jazz aficionado to enjoy Thursday Night Live. I take my son there to the Center for Creative Connections. It's almost um, like a surprise. You never know what's going to be there. The artist encounters are invaluable. First, the artist talks to us about what he or she does, photography, painting, video, and then we go out and look at paintings, sculptures, drawings, and they explain them and show them how they can be similar to your paintings or different. Then we come back and try to do it ourselves. The most exciting thing is that you can create your own artwork. You can also share that experience of your artwork with other people that are there with you. Also, you know, go see one particular collection or one gallery. They can move from one space that has contemporary work to another space that might have something completely different. My favorite thing about Thursday Night Live is just the spirit of art. You walk into the Dallas Museum of Art and it's filled with music, it's filled with people and conversations. You get to hear some incredible speakers and featured musicians. You get to speak with the artist at the artist encounters. You get to tour the, the galleries and the museum and it's all free for students. Uh -huh.